What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Magic XO here with another video. Hold on, watch out. Scoot, scoot up. How you guys doing today? Hope you like my hair. Freshly done. Another video for y'all. Quick, quick one. Might be long. Might be short. Who knows? Who cares? But I pray that everyone's been having a blessed day and a blessed lifestyle. Don't, don't let yourself get lost in this surf surface level living. Really ponder and meditate on what's been in your mind, what, what you've been thinking about, and try to investigate on the source of that thought, and investigate on how it actually applies to you, if it does and if it doesn't. If it doesn't, just try to see what you, where your mind goes. Allow yourself to have this time to give your brain space, not space, but room to either add on new information about yourself or just to release all the emotion or all the all the life you've been living release that life you've been living not release it but in a way give yourself time to reflect give yourself time to reflect if you have it but please we need I need for us as in humans to understand and try to connect with each other on a more enlightened level a lot of things in this world that's going on and continuously goes on is because of the constant pressure that is added on everyday living that we can go without or it's necessary but we don't need everyone's eyes on it in a way social media has allowed us to dive into a new aspect of living and because technology always changes so y'all can hear me bro technology always changes whether it's in the form of a machine form of speech or just any type of form of connecting a new form of living technology can not even your mind can grasp so much so don't limit yourself to just thinking on the surface level of thinking Allow yourself to be one with yourself. And don't don't try to glorify glorify your blessings. Because your blessings are made for you. Your blessings are made for you, my bad. Not not for the whole world to see. If they if you have an audience, understand that you're blessed because of what you went through. But there is also that's a higher power that is in control of everything that we're doing. That higher power is the great I am, the great God. Whether you want to believe it or not, it's up for you to understand. I'm not here to force anyone to feel neglected or feel like their their perspective on how they should live is incorrect. Your life is not incorrect. The way you think is not incorrect. The way you live is not incorrect. You just have to adjust, focus. You just have to change the way you're think change the way you think a little bit. Understand more what's what brings us all together, what brings you to you. Understand why you're here. Understand why you're present in this day and age. Things change constantly. Why do you think we live in this life? Why do you think we live a life that when you feel like you die, why do you feel like it's the end? Some people, like me, I don't think when I die that's that's definitely not the end. But it can be the end if you let it be. I'll let you do that research for yourself. You can do your research because I can only tell so much. If it don't resonate with you, I can't force feed you information. Or I can't feed, I don't want to steer you into my own feeling. Because I do what's best for me. And I can't tell you everything you need specifically. No one will be able to tell you what you need specifically unless they've been with you at the hip from day one. And even that, there will be some type of, there will be some type of, you know, adjusted needed to fit what you want. Everything's not meant for everybody, but everybody is meant to have something to themselves that can connect them to everybody on a day-to-day -day basis that allows everyone to be themselves, but comfortable to be themselves around anybody. Because we're, it's not, it's, it, it's so many people on this earth that we run into people on such a consistent basis 
people feel pressure or feel like they have to do or have to live a certain way because we have been put into a system or we have been we've just been born into this way to this life people are get feel like they can't change what they've been born into because of death death is not the end so take what you feel like from it as you will i say this message only to give you a better understanding and better direction to go towards if i'm corrupt not corrupt but if i'm ignorant in a way please give me the guidance you feel is necessary help me deep into well, deep into help me dive into what you feel like i might need some adjustment with because no matter what is told to me i'm gonna use what is told to me to apply to my life the best that don't mean i'm switching up i'm never switching up because if you didn't tell me what you need to tell me to help me clear, clarify what it is I'm trying to portray and try to help people understand, that was just another action and a tool of God to help me understand myself and understand his will on this earth. So if you have something important to say or you have a nice message you would like to leave, leave a comment and just leave a positive message in the bottom that you can revisit or you can help people see and revisit understand that life is going to change no matter where you're at life is going to change and understand only got only person that needs the glory at the end of the day is god give god glory every every chance you get because we can leave this we can leave this life at any moment we only have one life this is not an unlimited gta game so just stay one with yourself stay at peace Understand that the struggle that you're going through, the struggle that you might see in the future that you might not even come across yet, there will be a struggle in the development of your character. You just have to be able to stay within yourself and give God praise and give him the glory that he's, that he's going to get you past this. Understand anything that you go through, you will get past. It will come out tenfold. You will get it back. It's not even about getting it back. It's about the purpose. You have a purpose in here. You don't go through struggle without reaping a better reward internally and within with God. You have to understand. He's, he's just, you, we're his tools. We were born to give him glory. Whether it's us sleeping, us doing, you know, acting, us pursuing our own careers. As long as you give him glory at the start of everything, glorify him in every which way you can. Always glorify him. That's how you get through life, whether it's sad or not. Give them the glory while you're un while you're down bad. Give them glory while you're down bad. So when you're up, it's already second nature to you. And now you can just help spread people and help people around you to understand that you can get through whatever you want to. You can always do the you, whatever you feel like is impossible might not be impossible. You just have to stick through. Be persistent. Meditate on it. Get one within yourself. Yeah. That'll be just about it for right now. Until later. We'll see. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy my message. And I pray that you guys will understand and help share this message. Or include your message to help me understand you in a way. Because I love people. I don't like people. But I love people. <laughs> I, don't like people. I don't not like people. But I love my space. I'm not a extra extrovert type of person i like my own space i like my select few people and i stay out the way i live life better that way it's never steered me wrong until i have to i will do what is necessary until i feel like i need to do anything and god commands me to it's not gonna happen i promise you i do not want to be ignorant and fight the word because it will it will come back to bite you and it will still bless you at the end of the day but you can save yourself a whole lot if you understand and really think and meditate on what you're doing and do the research, understand. Don't critique something without under trying to understand why it was made. Anyway, that do it for today, guys. Maybe. Hope you like, comment, subscribe, share a spirit of not spirit, share a piece of positivity with somebody today. That's all I ask. Share a piece of positivity, motivation. Give glory to some give glory to God first. And make sure you share a piece of positivity with somebody else. That's all I ask. I don't want nothing. 
It's nothing you can give me. So, I just hope you enjoy. Bye-bye.